WFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN, 4 p.m. Eastern time as we reach the closing bell. And you got the S&P slightly in the red after accelerating higher intraday to a price tag of about 5,066 on the futures. We give up about 26 points from there. We finish out the session right at about 5,040, negative by just four points. NASDAQ 100, we're negative by about 75 points. That's about four tenths percent in the red after hitting 18,121 earlier. Dow holds on to some significant gains. We're up by about a third of a percent. We had 39,000 at one point briefly. We're more than 100 points off that price level. A little bit of a sell-off, but still positive. And the Russell, how about it, man? No pullback whatsoever in the Russell. Russell up by 35 points, 1.8 percent in the Russell. Russell's got a long way to go to catch the all-time highs, 2460. So still about 400 points or almost, um, yeah, 20% off of where it was at the end of 2021. Bitcoin having itself quite a moment, up to 50,420, up 2,600 bucks today. That's 5.5%. We're above 50,000 for the first time in a while for Bitcoin shares as they continue higher. Crude chopping around at recent highs, back to a daily here. Crude trading at 76.99, we're up by 15 pennies, but well off where we were just a week ago with a price tag of 71.41 as crude. Kind of challenging the recent highs right now at about $77. We'll see where that trades. Gold, negative by $4 in the session. 2034 right now in the gold contract. We jump to notes and bonds. You got the 10-year right now. Up by four ticks, as I mentioned. We're talking about a yield right now of about 4.17. Let's get it exactly, 4.172. Close enough, 4.17, the yield on the 10-year. We'll see if we get any action tomorrow morning at 8.30 for the CPI numbers into tomorrow, 4.17 on the 10-year. And as we've had the 10-year rise, we've had the dollar been rising as well, back to a daily. You've risen from 101 up to 104 and change. The dollar index today, basically flat. You're trading, uh, yeah, basically flat right now at 104.11 on the dollar. And Pay attention to the VIX. The VIX never went down today. Yeah, you did a little bit, but remember, check out this S&P. We'll finish on this one, all right? The S&P charged higher from 10 o'clock till 12 o'clock. We were higher into the open. And show me where the VIX pulled back. You know, yeah, I guess right here, okay? Point being, we closed out Friday at 12 handle. The VIX almost hit 14 today. So the market, somebody's buying insurance, folks. Uh, not outlandish at these price levels, not outlandish coming into an important economic data point tomorrow morning. Thanks so much, folks. Have a great night. Have a safe night. And I'll see you back here tomorrow morning, 9 o'clock. Have a great one, folks.